Iyakin abdu wa iyakin astayim. Ihdin as-sirat al-mustaqim. What do you think, when, uh, Miranda? What is the hijab? I think she looks beautiful in it. <laughs> is it easy to like, accept it like from the first? No. Uh, the religion is easy to accept, but I don't like all the the commitments and the restrictions. I don't like that. She's an American girl. Okay. And when she puts on all these restrictions, uh, she becomes something else. <coughs> to okay. me, not really, maybe, but you know, but that's just part of the deal. If she's going to be this religion, that's part of the deal. And it's something I've got to deal with. Okay, what do you feel when you go out with her, like for the, uh, dinner or lunch? Like before she became Muslim? And <laughs> I'm so, I'm, I'm really proud. And uh, when people look at her, uh, they, they, they have a sense of love, don't they? I mean, you talk about how they show love. It's so. No, I'm really proud of her. I'm, I'm proud to be with her when we go out. Beautiful that she wears the hijab. She looks nice in it, and it means a lot to her. And it keeps the focus on her, on her face, and what she's thinking. It keeps the focus on her mind rather than anything else. And I think it's a wonderful thing. I would wouldn't mind to wear one myself. Okay, there is a question from Abdullah Al Hayani. He said, "How was your life before you become Muslim?" No. Well, there's really no comparison, alhamdulillah. It's 100% better now. But I think in a lot of ways, I I was already becoming more of a Muslim like before I actually took my shahada. And um, I was already living as a Muslim in some ways. And I was trying to like, trying to become more like Muslim people. And, um, but I didn't have the good feelings about it like I do now. Like, I now it's just so much better. What do you think when um, you go out with her, like for dinner or lunch? Um, I, I'm not embarrassed at all. I mean, um, you know, she's Miranda to me. Either way, with, uh, you know, without a hijab or with a hijab, it's Miranda. <laughs> and. Um, uh, this one you got for me. Oh, yeah. I, and actually, I got this one for her. <laughs> um, I'm just so happy that she's happy, that it doesn't matter to me what she wears. Do you think uh, she's different after she became Muslim? Did you notice any difference or something? And anything? like right, Is it going yeah. Okay. Yes, I did notice something different. What I noticed, the difference was that there's always been something just a little bit sad about Miranda. Um, she was one of the best little girls in the whole wide world, but she was always a little bit sad, and I never knew why. And I think she's found what's making her happy, and that's what I believe. she's happy and that makes me happy there's nothing that can make me any happier than seeing one of my kids happy and this has brought that to her she smiles all the time except right now <laughs> she, smi <laughs> she smiles all the time and um, and something else I've noticed about her Miranda was always pretty quiet she was pretty shy and backward and this has really brought her out she likes to teach about this and every day I learn something new. Every day that I'm around her, or that I talk to her on the phone, I learn something new. And I think that's helping me as well as it's helping a lot of other people because I carry her knowledge with me and I and at work. I know at work. I work at the hospital here in Newcastle. Um, and, I, and I pass that along to my fellow workers and my patients. As things come up and they talk about some of the happenings in the world and they have a lot of misinformation and Miranda wants to make sure that 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 people are straightened out that they that they have the truth and I pass that along to them through her I mean I do she or if she passes it through me I guess I definitely have not lost friends since I became Muslim um, I know that some people might have that experience because some people 
might not be as comfortable to be around someone if they know that they're Muslim, if they are against that or something like that. But I have actually gained more friends and I haven't lost any friends, alhamdulillah. And I think I'm, I'm making more and more friends now that I'm Muslim because um, I don't know why. Never mind, I don't know, but I'm meeting, I'm meeting a lot of people and I'm happy. Um, and so far, I don't know the reaction of all my family members, but the family members who I'm really close to, for the most part, they're really happy about it because they know how happy I am. Um, I know that some family members who I'm close to might have kind of a problem with it, but I think that it's more of a misinformation problem and not really knowing why I do certain things. But I think that that'll be, hopefully that'll be solved and that won't be a problem. Um, but yeah, most of my family is actually reacting positively and my friends are really positive about it. A lot of people congratulated me from my classes even, just my acquaintances. And it's been positive. Even random people that I meet, they're, they're happy about it. I don't know why. <laughs> okay.